Apparently, it's true that cavemen are walking the streets of modern society. Welcome to Scientific Station. I'm Brendan Crawwell. And I'm Brittany Morgan. So, Brittany, there was a researcher who actually found DNA from cavemen, or what scientists call Neanderthal, and just a very, very small fragment, um, but enough that they could figure out what the DNA spelled out. And they were able to use that information to look for that in modern humans. And unbelievably, they found that modern humans carry that fragment of DNA that comes from the Neanderthal or the caveman. Uh, and so what the research implies is that there was a point after the Neanderthals and humans diverged where they started to mate again and then stopped but we and all humans descend from those humans that mated with neanderthals and we carry neanderthal dna in us mm -hmm. so i one of the things i was wondering about when i read that is if we're human and if i if i'm human and i have dna in me and you're able to find a segment that was in a neanderthal isn't it really still just human DNA? I would say so. Yeah. It's really just human DNA. It really is just human yeah. DNA. Oh, and the humans who would have mated with this, these Neanderthals, they wouldn't have been like us, really. So maybe they weren't human. And maybe it took that to make humans. Maybe. Oh, when you hear something about in the news when they talk about DNA like that what it, what does that do to you do you do you think that's just crazy or are you able to rationalize it I think that well you definitely have to tune in as soon as that type of um, information is given to you, you don't want to tune in like in the middle of it because then you're really lost but um, I think that it's valuable information and everyone is just at this point trying to figure out things and maybe we don't really need to figure them out. So. Well, we haven't known them for all this time. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, thank you, Brittany, and thank you for watching. For more information, visit scientificstation.com.